All right, patient presents with a Baker cyst, painful posterior to the knee. We know that they don't enjoy full knee extension. That increases tension on it, so they try to avoid it. We can tape them or help put them in a brace to avoid that. We also don't want to work on knee flexion because that compresses the posterior capsule as well, or posterior knee, Baker cyst. But we do want to work on joint mobility, so accessory mobility kind of more in mid-range, all right, helpful. We want to look at hamstring and gastroc length and then improve that length because both of those muscles cross the knee. So the more flexibility of those muscles, the less stress on the posterior knee. And then if something we can't control, we can refer out. Aspiration and injection are very beneficial as well. So we're going to tape the knee all right, into a little bit of flexion so we can't extend it. First, we'll put on some base tape. And again, we're gonna make an X on the posterior part of the knee. Uh, there's one. There's two. And now for Luco tape. So tack it down and kind of make sure you pull it tight. So there's tension on there. Pull it tight, put tension on the tape. Make sure that the Luco tape is not on the skin, it's on the white tape. So you can do a quick little test, right? Kind of have him try to extend his knee. He should feel tension, right? He should not be able to fully extend his knee. Okay, that kind of helps keep him in flexion, which takes tension and stress off of these sensitive structures. All right, thanks again, guys. Hope you enjoyed this mentoring minutes of Baker Cyst.